Greetings, Aziza Sacred Wellspring of Sacred Sister Soul Talks TV and Sacred Warrior Mothers. This podcast is entitled The Solar Feminine and the Christed Earth King. A friend sent me a voice note earlier today and I thought I would share it with you since it relates to this podcast. Here goes. You have the mind, which is a thought, and you have the heart, which is feeling. The heart is the wife, the female, and the mind, the husband, the male. When the two join together and become one, mountains move. End of quote. When the divine masculine and divine feminine become balanced as one, there is a pulsating golden glow that surrounds the love they share. They become one perfect balance. It becomes the hierogamous, the solar feminine and solar masculine. The hierogamous is a wedded garment of God. It refers to the risen crystals. The inner hierogamous, the heart and the head, is a union between the divine and man. It is a full resurrection of the body to the eternal light of the crystals or cosmic Christ consciousness. It is a law of gender. The law of gender states everything has a masculine and feminine quality and that everything has a gestation period. The solar feminine mediates the return of the Christ consciousness into men. She she transfers prime consciousness of the king in to men. One such woman was Empress Rosera Menin. She empowered Haile Selassie I to become the emperor through their divine union. By transferring that consciousness, she made him the true Alpha, the Lion of Judah. The solar feminine mediates the Christ consciousness into men and the anointing of the Christos into the masculine. Men receive the higher consciousness from the woman or the feminine descending into them. She carries the unified king within her, which is the true Alpha, that is, co-creating with the Omega. The woman has always given birth to the Christ consciousness, which activates the electric masculine. Since the woman carries the frequency of the Divine Feminine, she carries the staff code. The Divine Masculine carries the rod, thy rod and staff. She activates the rod or the jet in men. There ends our broadcast. You can follow me on YouTube at Sacred Sister Soul Talks TV. If you want to be added to my WhatsApp group, Strictly the Facts, you can send me an email with your phone number and name, and I will add you into that group. I want to share with you some information about a, um, an empowerment group or Um, I should say a movement and it's called Sacred Warrior Women. To support Sacred Warrior Women, you can hashtag Sacred Warrior Mothers on your podcast or quotes whenever you send them out. You can hashtag Sacred Warrior Mothers. Sacred Warrior Mothers is a movement that seeks to awaken our people to the healing from the trauma of the past. Hashtag Sacred Warrior Mothers on your post. Follow us on YouTube, Instagram, WhatsApp, TikTok, and Telegram. I end this by saying, each one teach one, we all might reach some. Thank you for listening. Peace and blessings.